Hi, this tutorial shows you how to set up the Build Random Location Tables program to automatically launch the Build Tiebreaker Files program. Currently, Rosie, a warehouse manager, has to undergo a two step manual process. First, run the Build Random Location Table program and then run the Build Tiebreaker Files program to map or set up random rules in the warehouse management system. When she forgets to run the Build Tiebreaker Files program, the locations are not sorted based on the tiebreaker rules. To avoid this, JD Edwards Enterprise One has come up with a solution enabling you to automatically launch the Build Tiebreaker Files program from the Build Random Location Table program. Let's start by signing into Enterprise One. Enter the program number, which is R46821. Select the version you want to run. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will run XJDE0001. Next, we set the processing option value as 1 in the Launch Build Tiebreaker Files field. Click OK. We will start by taking the first scenario of selecting a single branch plant in the R46821 program. Access Data Selection and select the branch plant value for the Build Random Location Table program. Now, Access the Build Tiebreaker Files program. Access Data Selection and enter the same values that we entered in the Build Random Location Table program. Now, let's run the programs for selected locations under a single branch plant. For an illustration purpose, let's consider the same branch plant. Access Data Selection and enter the values for the Build Tiebreaker Files program. You can select the locations that you prefer. To do that, select the location and select literal. You can add the locations of your choice in the list of values by entering the location and clicking add. You can add multiple locations under the same branch plant. The next scenario that we will go through is selecting multiple branch plants in the build random location table program for specific locations in the build tiebreaker files program. In the data selection section for the build random location table program, enter the values for one branch plant and then click add to add another branch plant. Follow the same step to enter the values for multiple branch plants. Click submit. Enter the values for the build tiebreaker files program. You can select the locations that you prefer. You can do this by entering multiple locations for the selected branch plants in the list of values following the actions in the previous step. We will select multiple branch plants using the Build Random Location Table program as shown in the previous scenario. Enter the values in the Build Tiebreaker Files program to select all the locations under those branch plants. For more details on this enhancement, you can refer to the Warehouse Management Guide. For more information, visit us online at learnjde.com. Thanks for watching.